Hey, what's going on guys? Wildside here, and today I've got an achievement guide for the Soul Crystal achievement in Unturned 3.16.4.0. This achievement is a massive puzzle that took the unofficial Unturned subreddit several hours to figure out, and the way you're going to start it is by going to this Stonehenge-like village that was added in the update. The village is located on a mountain to the northeast of Karyev, and once you find it, if you look inside of this one home, you will find a rune on the wall as well as a letter down on the floor. The letter reads, Fascinating. Once we cracked the first several symbols, the rest came very easily. From what we can tell so far, these etchings seem to be a recording of the tribe's history. A particular note is the large faded icon. It's composed of runes representing nighttime, whispers, a harvest, and what they describe in the text as a soul crystal of immense power activated by some sort of ritual. It was so powerful that even the most pure-hearted exposed would gradually be swayed to ruthless ambition. After a horrible incident, the tribes were forced to unite and fracture it, each secretly encasing a piece in stone such that no one person should know the location of all the fragments. This tribe buried their part in a tomb guarded by their spirit ancestor, Anastasia. I'm interested to see if we can find this relic, however, I'm sure it was purely of superstitious or traditional importance. So, remember everything that that note said, because it's all of very much import of quite a lot importance to this achievement. But however, the first thing that you have to notice is that the note itself mentioned that it was protected by Anastasia. Now, for those of you who have explored the Russia map before, you'll know that there is a note in a gas station in St. Petersburg that mentions that it was owned by an Anastasia. So that's the first hint, and you have to travel to St. Petersburg. Once you get to St. Petersburg, you're going to have to head underground since it was stated that the soul crystal was buried underground. So what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to make your way to the middle of the city under the military tent and go down into the sewers. Now something that was added in this update was that now when you're underground in St. Petersburg everything goes completely pitch black so you're going to need some sort of light source like a tactical light a torch or a military or civilian night vision goggles because otherwise you will not be able to see anything so once you get down and have gotten your way to see what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to head down to the end of the train tracks, past all the trains. Once you get down there, you're going to find this door that has another one of those runic symbols on it. Now, if you remember, remember the note said that it mentioned nighttime and whispers. So what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to, at night, whisper the name of the guardian, Anastasia. And the way you do that is is by saying Anastasia in area chat. Doing this in front of the door will open it up and sh uh, reveal the fragment of the soul crystal that was hidden in this tomb. But however, it doesn't end there. What you're going to have to do now is perform the ritual mentioned in the note in order to activate it. And the way to do that is to charge it up by killing zombies near it. Now this can be done many ways, but the... E by far the easiest way is to just simply plop a horde beacon on top of it. So, what you so you just plop your horde beacon on and then just wait for the zombies to come. Uh so I'm just going to fast forward here and go through this, but once you kill the requisite amount of zombies, which I'm wasn't able to get an accurate count, but it seems that it is around 30 zombies. Once you're done with that, you'll be teleported into a secret SORP 7 lab. Now, in here, there's uh, multiple letters scattered about explaining the tests that they were doing on the actual soul crystal. Uh, if you want to read those, make sure to check them all before you go downstairs and look at the soul crystal, because as soon as you go near the soul crystal, you'll get the achievement and will be teleported out. So all you need to do to get the achievement is walk up right in front of the soul crystal, it'll make a little poof, and then you'll get the achievement and get teleported out. 
And that's pretty much it. That's how you get the Soul Crystal achievement in Unturned 3.16.4. Oh. A huge thanks to the uh, unofficial Unturned subreddit and all the guys over on their Discord chat. We actually worked for about uh, five hours after this um, update came out to try and figure out what to do.